range of up to 450 kilometers, spacious as a Golf and affordable as a Polo. This is the way Volkswagen Group introduced this new ID to all and why ID to all because Volkswagen it's like a popular brand and in the past was a popular brand for everybody and they were all known for the affordable vehicle uh, in the last years I know was not so affordable but Volkswagen with the new ID for all want to start a new era a new era of electricity and as we already know Volkswagen actually uh, claim that they want to add 10 new electric models by 2026 and the first of this range is the new ID2 all it's a crazy car and I want to make this video for you guys I just want to present you this car because I think this is something different this is something special uh, this is a car that we will see on the street at least in Europe uh, we will see a lot of this ID2 all uh, the practicality it's incredible I also study a little bit the car before I make this video and the numbers and the practicality of the car technology uh, and the way it looks is just uh, fabulous I think this will be a really interesting car that I'm looking forward to see also in the future here I will show you some images that I have with the car for the moment and I will give you also the technical data and all the information of the car but um, I hope as soon as I get the car uh, to make a proper full review and also a test drive will be really interesting in the future so for that uh, click the subscribe button uh, to see some the, the next notification the next videos that will come with this car so first of all let me start with some technical data about the car and then we will go forward and I will explain you a little bit more about the car so first of all uh, the car will be based on the MIB entry platform this is the platform that Volkswagen will use it also on the future uh, ID or electric cars uh, it's a front wheel drive this is something new because this is for the first time when Volkswagen will mount the electric motor on the front as you probably know on the ID uh, until now ID group ID family the motor actually was built on the rear or it was all wheel drive so this is for the first time when we will see a front wheel drive and this is really interesting I'm really looking forward to see, to see how good will be the stability on the acceleration because usually the electric cars that have the traction on the front uh, they are kind of slippery when you try 0 to 100 and accelerate and I'm looking forward to see that now the output and the power of the car that it's presented here this ID2 all will have 226 horsepower 166 kilowatt this is the power that they uh, actually present the car probably we will see it also in a more different version but that's uh, something that we will look in the past, in the future uh, also the range of the car vltp hold on 450 kilometer vltp it's incredible i mean for such a small car probably will have a small battery we not we are not sure of until now which how big will be the battery but i guess the battery will be somewhere around 60 kilowatt we will see that it's really interesting they claim that you can charge the car from 10 to 80 percent in 20 minutes also 0 to 100 under 7 seconds this is also good numbers the top speed of the car will be limited to 160 km per hour uh, the length of the car will be 4 meters also the width of the car 1 meter 80 and the height of the car 1 meter 50 wheelbase of the car 2 meter 60 now the storage volume this is incredible I mean for this car that I think is the size of a Polo we have 490 liter in the trunk and if you fold down the seats completely you will have around 1330 liters and what it's incredible it's something that I see the car have a storage space under the back seat you can open it and you can put the cables or different storage also I see that in the trunk you have plenty of space and you can also fold down the passenger seats in the front and this is incredible I mean it's crazy practical 
for the size of the car also the wheels of the car presented in this video it's 20 inch uh, rims but we will see also in the future with what kind of uh, rims the car will come also another thing that i noticed from the video and from my experience i see that volkswagen had on the car a lot of ambient light i can see it has ambient light on the doors on the downside on the upper side uh, on the dashboard uh, also on the center console i like very much also the chrome design that they entering on the upper headrest uh, of the seats the seats are pretty similar pretty simple uh, in design the side support i don't think it's that good so probably will not be built like a sporty car it's probably more like a practical city car but also we see some great features and also Volkswagen claim that the car will come with the, the newest safety features like travel assist. The car comes also with IQ light. It comes also uh, with electric vehicle route planner. That's great because we will have in this new multimedia system. I see here it's, it has a new software, uh, a better, bigger screen. Uh, much more visible I think will be super responsive and also this route planner uh, it's great because we can see all that charging station cockpit it's bigger it's much better than the ID family that we have until now and there you can see more information and it will be uh, customizable in many ways also the steering wheel pretty simple I like that it's it's the the simplicity of the interior it's really really nice also the car will come with two wireless uh, charging for your phone and this is great uh, because not many cars offer the possibility to charge wireless two phones smartphones in the same time uh, also other than that talking a little bit about the exterior i see that the mirrors are quite aerodynamic we have small mirrors and uh, this is this is quite impressive uh, in terms of aerodynamic i think the car will do uh, pretty well as well i think in the future we will see these uh, design design language from Volkswagen also on the next cars and I'm looking forward uh, to see what new cars will come in the future so guys tell me what you think about the car in the comments down below also if you have question ask me uh, in the description of the video I will leave all the technical data of the car if you're curious don't forget to like share subscribe and if you want to see in the future the test drive and the full review with this new Volkswagen ID to all um, click the subscribe button and stay safe see you in the next one bye guys